Hey there, folks. Welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Asperia. I'm the Mysterious JG, and uh, off screen, uh, Candy Cane here, aka Rita, like Candy Cane from Rumble Rose's Double X Superstar outfit. Um, she played some poker, and they got pretty lucky on the uh, double your bet thing, and uh, I think we've got enough to buy a bunch of these prizes now, so let's see. Unless I, yeah, we should be good. Well, maybe not every single prize that you can possibly get, but we should be pretty good. All you have to, I think you just have to buy the really expensive one. So final symbol. Which you're allowed to buy again, but let's buy one of each until we can't afford it anymore. Miracle Bangle. And we're not there yet. Oh, here we go. Wow, amazing, you've gotten so many rare treasures. We've never had anyone this lucky before. Oh, really? There was only one of each of them, so I figured they might be valuable. Well, there wasn't one of each. You could have bought more. Indeed, out of all the items we have, those were very special. Well, this is a lot of fun. We got a ton of chips, too. Yeah, and Judith had such a good time playing, too. The games are all so simple and fun. I, sorry, the games are all so simple and fun. I guess it just suit me well. I've been watching you, too. It seems you're quite the experienced gambler. Oh, why do you say that? I was watching you while you played poker. The expression on your face never changed. You've got quite the poker face. Shades of poker face, Goldemont! You think something like a little hand of poker could phase our Judy? Judy, Judy, Judy. Hey, hey, what's that a compliment I just heard? Truly, truly, I'm most impressed. You're the best gambler who's ever visited our establishment. Judith earned the poker face title. We have a huge variety of prizes available. Get out there and earn some chips. I wonder if Poker Face gives her the same outfit, or if it returns her to her default. I'm just curious. It doesn't really matter. Nope. So back it is, a legendary gambler, because Poker Face is not the thing. Okay, so I'm le reading through the list. We have, in fact, done everything that sh we were told to do for the first couple of... Gamble for enough chips to earn the jackpot achievement. I guess I didn't do that. I'm kind of surprised. Let's real quick showcase what I did. Um, won't spend a ton of time on this, but... Wow, I still got 50,000 chips. The frustrating thing is you can only bet 500 to begin with, because otherwise you could save load your way to making this very easy to get a huge amount of chips. But here I already got a pair of threes um, and a joker. This is a pretty good start. So we'll pull the ace and the nine just in case we can get another three and get four of a kind. And we ended up three of a kind. So that gives us 1,500 and we go to the double bet game. So if you get lucky and you can do this like four or five times in a row, like you keep getting king and then two and then queen and then three, it uh, doubles each time. So there, just blew it. Did not win there, of course. Six nine seven four three. Not really a whole lot going on here. Yeah, this is actually not not really good. We got one pair, so we didn't lose any money. I kind of now I kind of want to showcase winning. Uh, not sure why I care about doing this on screen actually. I mean, you guys get how it works, but I, I kind of don't want to start off worse than I started. Five, six, seven. If this came, if we can get, we might be able to get a um, straight out of this. Yep. So we'll try doubling this. Uh, this is a not a good, yeah, not a good, it's right out of the middle of the deck. We have a kind. If I stop trying to double my bet, I could probably do pretty good here. Cause like, I, all I really got to do is get back over 50 something K and I'm good. See, I'm just no luck with this. I 
few minutes and I did really well off camera. And now that I've got the camera recording me, I'm having no luck at all. Three of two jokers, jeez. This isn't really... Yeah, let's quit there. Get back up to 53. Um, if I get up to 60k, I'll stop. I'm addicted to I can stop anytime I want, folks. I'm not an addict. I really should have stopped there. Yeah, I really should have stopped there. That would have given me enough that I would have been where I said I needed to be. Full house, nice. We want to push our luck one more. If we can get one more below 10. Okay. And now we stop. And we're over 60,000. Yeah. You play around with it like that for a bit and you do okay. Eventually. Come back again. Come back and try again later. How did this one work again? There's different 50 chips, 100 chips, 500. We'll try each one once. Ten magic lens for 500 chips? Really? Oh, that is a ripoff. 30,000 gold. A font stone. A. That's awful. Sorry if the machine furthest. Okay. Whatever. All right. So what am I actually supposed to be doing? How much chips do I have now after all that nonsense? I'm still over the 65, and I can back out without playing, so. Alright, I'm actually supposed to be going to the stage, watch the insanity, get the costumes. Okay, so I guess this is more costumes, if I just go to the stage. Who are you? You are someone I can't talk to. Who are you? You are someone I can't talk to. Alas, woe is me. When sorrows come, they come not single spies, but in battalions. Excuse me, is something the matter? Oh, why, oh. Hey, why are you looking at us like that? You creep, learn some manners. Jesus, Rita. Oh, pardon me, I apologize. I'm a member of the Actors Guild. Showtime. Not HBO. We never asked who you were. <laughs> Fuck you, Rita. You're almost as bad as Rita. Ever since that strange monster appeared in the sky, the other members have stopped coming to perform. Please take their place on stage. All of you are just the right height. I think their costumes would fit perfectly on you. Interesting coincidence. Ooh, this sounds like fun. At this rate, we'll lose all our credibility and our guild will be through. Please help us, I beg of you. Please clean the taint. How could anyone turn down someone in such obvious distress? But I wonder if we could really pull it off. Oh, we all help? Okay. There are four parts to play. I'm so glad you'll help. You will always be my friend, just like Quigley. There are four parts to play, so I'll need the young man, the pretty girl, the foul mouth girl, and the boy to act in the play. Which, who's the pretty girl? The show will be starting soon, so please go and change and learn your lines as fast as you can. Men are this way, women are that way. Men walk like this, women walk like that. I guess the girls were Rita and Estelle. 
Hey, hey, quit your pushing. So these are the costumes. Wow, Rita, yours is so cute. Ugh, do I really have to wear this piece of trash? No way, I'm not doing it. I mean, no way, I'm not doing it. Yeah, you can't make me wear that. Man, no matter how you look at it, these are some pretty butt-ugly clothes. At least you're better off than I am. They even seem to fit your personality a bit. This is going to be great. I love a play. I once went to see a play by John Minnington Sin. Well, okay. Well, since it seems I blew the additions on this one, I might as well go and find me a seat in the audience. Woof. This is Zany, folks. After some out. Oh, the narrator it looks to me like the narrator is, um. Judith. After some out, he got those obstacles there, but still, was finally able to turn to the Dark Lord's castle. Dark Lord Yuri, I will defeat you and rescue the princess. Ooh, looks like she means business. A heroine to save me! Uh, 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 what can a measly human like you hope to accomplish? Today you will meet your maker. Prepare yourself, heroine Estelle. Carol, my minion, get her. Boy, this is not good. Both like you is not worthy of crossing swords with the Dark Lord. We don't follow the dark path, miss. Take this, yo. Yeah. Uh, heroin. She looks like she's on heroin. Now it's my turn. Why, oh, eek. Oh, the action scenes are great this time around. Oop. And now for the fatal blow. She uses a fatal strike and the ring, I guess. What lame special effects. Trying to spice things up a bit. Uh-oh. Oh, whoa, what the heck is this? Boom. It's zany, folks, it's zany. I'm done for! Wow, the choreography is excellent. That minion's acting was great, too. He wasn't acting. He wasn't tough acting, it's an act. Oh, heroin! Prepare to die, Dark Lord! You need to learn some humility, human. You think that's enough to stop me? Swinging vaguely in my direction? Yuri, let me beat you like it says in the script. Nah, this is way more exciting. Let's keep fighting a bit. Oh, okay, maybe that's even better. It's a good thing they can read each other's thoughts. Well, this is great, amazing. I suppose if, like, a real magical explosion appeared between two actors live on stage, it would be pretty cool. Heroin, look out! And the Dark Lord, too! Arr! Oh no, the princess suffered a direct hit! That wasn't in the script. I don't think you're meant to be saying that. And she destroys them both. Ha ha ha. Perhaps our shenanigans have gone a bit too far. Why'd you have to hit me too? And thus Princess Rita... And thus Princess Rita slayed the Dark Lord herself and her sword piece to the world. The end. Pay to me, Gora. Thanks to you, the performance went off without a hitch, even though you completely improvised. I'll never work with either of you again. I mean, even though... Never mind. Thanks to you, without a hitch, whatever. If you ever get another chance, feel free to come and act in another one of our shows. You've got to be kidding me. Come on, don't you think it was a nice change of pace? Yes, it was very fun. I had a great time. That's better than the singing in Final Fantasy VI. I think I've had enough of acting for a long time. Oh, I just remember. I just remembered. The costumes you used on stage are yours to keep for some bizarre reason. Think of them as souvenirs of your time on the stage. We'll work hard to have even better performances, which shouldn't be that hard. I'll never forget Brave Asperia Acting Guild Extraordinaire. Brave Asperia is on an acting guild. We're a warehouse organizing guild. I mean, jury said that. Never mind. Yuri earned the Improvenous title, Estelle earned Heroic Actress, we got some shields and swords, Carol earned Brilliant Sport Role, and Rita earned Spotlight Card. Huh. Cute. And everybody gets to keep their goofy costumes. I suppose we can let him keep that for a while, and she can keep that for a while. This... Well, you know... God, it looks like it was built for panty shots, doesn't it? I wasn't done with uh, the witch costume yet. And, um... No, this is 
I'm sorry, this is dumb. He's back to being warehouse. No, warehouse master is it. He's going back to his regular costume. Pede just gets the shaft on this whole costume deal. Okay, so we got all that. Um, there is an achievement, the jackpot achievement, if we gamble for enough chips. I don't know that I care. On your second playthrough, you can view all the skits in the gymnasium for an achievement. Be sure to speak to the antline by dispensers. Rita, you were resisting at first, but you really got into the app, didn't you? No, I didn't. Shut up! No, you were just taking your part so seriously. I had no choice but to follow along. Your sure. costume was pretty cute, too. What a nice treat for all of us. Mm -hmm. Hey! Your acting was really on point, Carol. <laughs> well, I used to be in the Actors Guild after all. You've been he in all was. sorts of guilds, kid. You anyway, sucked at everything. I wasn't even acting. I'd like to act in another play with everyone else someday. No way. Never. Everyone else in me the world. Neither. Everyone who isn't you, you guys. Me on fire again. I'd like to be in the play next time. I'd have to be the lead, of course. I had my doubts, but it looks like everyone had a good time. Carol's like, I will set myself on fire and breathe my last. Alright, so in New Game Plus, I guess you can do more stuff here. In the meantime, that guy wandered off. Maybe we can actually talk to him now. Yeah. You guys know the Showtime Play Guild is here for the performance. Sure. Yeah. So we leave this way. We run into this guy where we couldn't get in before, right? No, we end up on the roof. This is where, oh, he's not here now. Okay, so we can go back in. I don't know. So yeah, there's stuff we can do here in New Game Plus that we can't do now. I was kind of vaguely wondering if we... Be yeah, there's other stuff we can be looking... We never did whatever this is. I guess we should see what this is. Come on, come on, look at this. What's this? Looks like a model design. Enthusiasm seems to be waning at this point. What's this? It looks like a model of a strange shape. It's the model Rick Martel. Yes, it's a model, a model. Is this guy's way of talking ticking you off? Anyone else, or is it just me? Jesus, Rita. No, I feel you. It's heard everything that you've been saying. Everything, what you were talking about here and there. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Put it in words we can understand. Peek, peek inside. You'll understand when you see. No problem. You understand when you see. No problem. Maybe we should just have a look. Yeah, good idea. For the experience, nothing else. This thing's gonna capture your soul when you look inside. Why, why is everyone looking at me? You're the closest and the shortest, too. It's easiest for you to do it. Alright, all right, here goes nothing. Having friends to talk to really makes traveling a lot more fun. Do <laughs> it. by myself, I get a little scared. Uh, I mean, bored. Yeah, uh-huh. Oh hey, maybe I can go back and replay those sketches that we what? missed. Oh, my mistake. I must be seeing things. Well, I don't remember what they were don't called though. That. Our trip just got more lively. That was an early game one. Oh, that's awesome. I remember saying that. What the heck? You can call it the chat player five. It shows you the conversations, the ones in your heads from long, long ago. Creepy. I'm fairly lost, but this lets you read conversations you had a long time ago then. Yeah. Well, it seems pretty handy. We should be able to put it to some good use. We can use it whenever we want, right? No, I mean, yes. You can use whatever you like. Alright, we'll come again then. So can I actually pick the sketches? Take a look. Oh, I can. Oh. Oh, okay, so I can actually... What about the Vichy Swaz thing? All right. On today's menu we have God damn it. So they're not... Wow, the names don't make any great. sense, so there's no way for me to actually navigate these to, to look at the ones that this you didn't see. Boo-hoo! Mine's a golem? Wow. You even got all the details right. You're really talented, Carol. <laughs> so are they good? I spiced it up by adding some... Huh? What are you eating? Oh, it's so cute. I don't want to ruin it by eating it. I you can to have your it. cake and eat it too. Come on, eat up! Don't stare! Eat it already! I worked really hard! You're <laughs> really 
Rita just looks sad. Um, ah, actually, these are, these two are the ones. Okay, call it what it is. You missed. It was Zany. Let's watch. Estelle, your potato soup sure is good. I'm not used to soup being cold, but this is really delicious. This shit it's not cool. potato soup. It's called vichyssoise. Estelle, what would you call a soup made from onions? That would be onion soup, but then this is potato soup. No, it's vichyssoise. It's the name of the dish. Hey, Rita, what would you call this soup? Potato soup. Why won't any of you call it vichyssoise? Fuck all y'all. And then I think we missed this one. Yuri's croquettes are the best. How strange. They're just balls of mashed potatoes, but there must be a secret ingredient. Oh, yeah? What'd you put in it, Yuri? What's in your balls, Yuri? <laughs> Who are you? What'd you do with Yuri? My hearing isn't what it used to be. What'd you say the secret ingredient was? Love. The lady who ran the inn where I lived always said cooking was all about love. So the my love my balls that I just gave so you are full of love. Okay. Yuri's love-filled croquettes. Ugh. I wish they weren't so good. A secret ingredient is a cook's greatest treasure. You didn't want to tell them, did you? Actually, I didn't put anything special in there at all. Yeah, I mean, am, am I the only one who thinks that the perp that this is um that this is all about um he put something sick in his croquet? Hey there, welcome, welcome. How's it hanging? I'll show you something you don't see every day, and then he pulls down his little cow costume and shows off his udders. If you know what I mean, his udder. Mm, looks like a regular old model to me. It's the model Rick Martel. This is why I don't like giving the presentation to amateurs. Meh. Anyway, have a look, will you? He's just talking to us like he knows us, and yet, it's really getting on my nerves. Try not to let it roll you up so much, Rito. I mean, seriously, chill the fuck out. Come on now, enough mumbling to yourselves. Look, look. Ah, uh, uh, me. You're better than the ever curious Captain Carol. It's right there. Just do it. What do I always have to be the guinea pig? You're getting to be pioneered a group twice in a row. I think you should be proud. I wonder what they say if you do this first. You're just trying to make me feel better about it. Oh, okay, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna do it. Okay, so I guess this lets us go back and watch the animated plot sequences, but only the, like, pre-rendered ones. Please be a tree. Be a tree. You're just a man, I love it when she communicates Stop. with trees. Gets me, gets me hot, what can I say? Wayne Bloom, come save us! And bring Mike Enos with you! Yep. Remember this, folks? I remember this. 100 plus videos ago when we saved Halur by getting Bugbear Claw and whatever the fuck else. Oh, so I remember when that happened, and now I got to see it happen again. I even got to see myself because it was this weird omniscient third person view. See, I told you this isn't something you see every day now, is it? This wonderful device has all too appropriate name of Movie Player B. Oh, it's a remake of the original B series with the aliens who eat rats but disguise themselves as humans, but actually lizards. Its only function is to let you watch events that have already happened. Easy as pie. This is some truly remarkable blast here. This is some crazy ass shit. Blast here, that shabby excuse for technology. You underestimate us. Our dark powers go far beyond. Shabby, what do you mean, shabby? Rita, chill. We're getting rid of all Blastia, you know that, right? So, we can look at this whenever we want, right? Sure, why not? So long as you wash your hands before using it, yep. Oh, and try not to hit or kick it either. I'll hit or kick you. You don't need to worry, we're all mature individuals here. Welcome to see it again. Yep. We sure will. No, we won't. But we could. We have that option. And yeah, we're done with this place, I believe, forever, although maybe not. Uh, we're... 
Got to go to Capoatorum, which I don't think we've been to. Oh, wait a minute. That's to teach Carol Rending Drop, which I think he already knows. Yeah, we already got that scene. Sort of by mistake, but it is what it is. Kiev Mach. Enter for Carol's Golden Soldier costume and a letter of challenge. Okay. Kiev Mach was the forest that, for a long time, was our thin plot excuse for Rita not to leave our party, was that she was going to come with us to investigate the strange crazy forest at Kiev Mach, of Kiev Mach, so. When we come in here, oh great, straight to a scene, I'm, was not really wanting to wander around several screens of, you know, long since outclassed enemies looking for this to pop. Woof. Find something, repeat? I got, you know, the devil, like, the, like, glam rock devil costume, I don't know how long I'll be able to have Yuri wearing that. I'm a, I'm kind of enjoying the, the new costumes for all of the female characters, actually. Woof woof. Arg. Oh man, that's a beat up honey blades. Those guys are honey blades. What a bunch of jobbers. What the hell happened? We were done by a huge monsters. Arg, if only the chief were here. Arg. Nan's all alone, please. Oh man, we gotta rescue her again. Nan! No! Hey, what are you doing charging by yourself, you dumb little? I I'll go too. It's finally Carol's time to shine, don't you think so? No, it's... It's time to get murdered by this monster. It's time to shine? Shiri. It's time to die in Japanese. <sighs> oh, Nan. I mean, how many times does this have to happen before you suck it up and admit that, like, Carol is your love interest and you're totally into him? Kisha! Punishing smash! I mean, punishing smash! Dan, are you okay? Carol, why are you? Yeah, what happened here? <laughs> Just kind of wandered in a little late. Nan, explain this. Well, man's got to know his limitations, Clint. So does a girl, apparently. Oh, uh, yes, sir. I uh, knew when the others went in to hunt for the monsters, a, a huge monster suddenly appeared. And that monster beat everyone. Yes, but Carol, Carol defeated the monster. She talks like female Carol now. Oh, but I didn't do it alone. Carol, you did this. Tut, tut, tut. Uh, uh. You have us out. You have my thanks. This kind of makes up for you ditching our guild, I guess. Uh, er? Not every day that the chief thanks someone. Anyway, you have my thanks as well. I thank people, like, every second. He really looked in the opening cinemas like um, he was going to be like some kind of insane freak villain, but I guess not. Oh, no, I mean, you don't have to. This is for you. And then she um, lays a big wet smooch on him. Actually, maybe that is where it's going. Oh, what's this? It's a piece of clothing I made from the fangs of tusks of monsters that I slew recently. They're not the most amazing golden tusks. If tusks were made of gold... I thought it wouldn't look right on anyone who wasn't strong enough, but I think it will suit you just fine. Oh, you mean? Well, I'm going now. The next time I see you... Tell her that I love her. Next time you see her. Tell her that I care. Next time you see her. Tell her that I love her. And next time I see you. Boy, you better beware. Because if I see you again. I will surely kill you in hip hop. I'm going to be stronger, too. Oh, okay. Well, sure, I guess. You are a small girl. You'll probably get stronger as you grow older. Looks like she dropped something. Her panties. <laughs> Boom! Your yeah, pure monster skills are panty droppers, Carol. I'm sorry. It's getting late. I'm a little loopy. And I'll get stronger, too. And I'll drop my panties. You're in the Golden Soldier title and obtained Letter of Challenge Hunting Blades. Okay, so that's actually tied into the whole 200-man melee quest. Give it a second to see if there's a scene. There isn't. Um, 
What does the Golden Ninja Warrior title mean for him? Probably nothing, but you never know. If it's a new costume. Golden Soldier. Oh, it is a new costume. I'm a Ninja Warrior. <laughs> he has weak attributes, though. What is that about? Oh, Ultimate Red Cape. Why did I give him that, then? I must have been fighting some specific... Um... You know what? He actually needs this because he runs through TP like a son of a bitch. But uh, yeah, he must have... Okay, yeah, it was the, it was the item I... The accessory I'd given him. Do I want to call it a video here? Uh... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh. Huh. I'm trying to figure out if this would be a good point to stop the session or what. Yeah, this might be a good point to stop the session. Alright. Didn't get quite as much done as I'd hoped, but you never really do, do you? We're going to save our game. We're going to put a card face down in our graveyard. When we come back, we've got, um... Well, we've got more side quest stuff to do. I think we're in striking distance of actually going in and playing through the ancient tower Tarkaron, but, um... Draki still kind of wants us to go into Tarkaron fight enemies, get item drops, and then come back out for more side quest stuff. Yeah. Some of this is stuff, though, that we probably can't even do on a first playthrough. But, whatever. When we come back, folks, eventually, there will be more fun and side quest adventure. And, uh... Almost everybody is in exciting new costumes. I'm Mysterious CG. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.